Hi guys, my name is Mervyn Vegas and today we are at the Long Island Children's Museum where we will be talking about Feast for Beast. So here we are going to be talking about what animals eat. So before we go to the different activi activities, I just want to tell you that there are three types of consumers. One type of consumers or animals eat only plants and vegetables. They are called herbivores. Then we have another type that eat only meats. They are called carnivores. And the last type uh, is omnivores where they eat both plants and animals. So quickly let's go through the museum, uh, Feast of Beast Museum and uh, let's see what certain animals eat. So come on, follow me. These are herbivores. They eat only plants, fruits, vegetables. So which which animals would that be? Let's find out. For example, we have herbivores that eat only bark. That's the outside of a plant. So which animal would that be? Let's try. Ready? There you go. That's an elephant. An elephant eats the outside of a tree, the bark. So they are herbivores. Let's try another one. It says this animal eats grass. Which animal would that be that eats only grass? It take. It, swallow, it doesn't swallow it directly, it chews and chews and munches for a long time. Which animal would that be? Ready for this? It's a cow. It grinds the food, it eats the food, only grass. And let's do another one. Which animal do you think eats seeds and nuts? Seeds and nuts. It's a bird. Can you guess which one? It's a parrot. Or any bird. They eat nuts. And seeds. And last but not the least, let's try another one. This animal, it's an insect, uh, it eats flower nectar, the juice from the flower. Which one would that be? Ready for this? It's a honeybee. So guys, so we're going to go to the next section and uh, we're going to talk about omnivores. Thank you.